Hi, my name is Clint Cooley. I'm the president of Circuit Cool Electronics in Richardson, Texas. In my hand, I'm holding the Beagle XM. This is a new reference design for Texas Instruments showcasing the 3730 processor. Today, we're going to show you how Circuit Co builds the BeagleBoard XM. The first production stage is printing the board. Here you're seeing the operator using our ZivaTech machine printing the bottom side of the XM BeagleBoard. Printing is very critical to ensure that you have proper paste, uh, density, and volume. The sensors are all laser cut here locally. The next step in the process is pick and place. Here you see the operator loading the beagle board into the Juki pick and place machine. This machine places 15,000 parts per minute and is fully rated for production. Also we can do pick the pop process directly from the machine using our fluxer as an add-on to the Juki. Next is reflow. Maximum temperature peak is 265 degrees C. After reflow the board goes through a wash process to clean. After the cleaning process is done, the board goes to QC inspection with an automatic optical inspection machine. Here you're seeing the board going through its burn-in. Burn-in is, is 48 hours and each board goes through this process. Next is functional test. All interfaces external are tested. The four USB host, LAN, DVI, S-Video, Audio, OTG, USB, and camera. Also internally, we're doing DDR testing on memory and OMAP signals. After the functional test, the board goes on to final uh, packing and then off to the customer. Thank you for watching our video and your interest in the Beagle XM. If you have any questions, please visit our website at www.circuitco.com. Thank you.